Next, we'll crochet the tail with red yarn. Working into a magic ring, wrap the yarn around your fingers like this. Make a loop around your middle finger and pinch the crossover of the yarn. Insert hook into loop on middle finger, yarn under the hook and pull up a loop. A magic ring is formed. In round 1, start with one chain stitch and then work 4 single crochets. Finally, end with one slope stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Then work four single crochets. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Then continue to work three more single crochets in the same way. Four single crochets are down. Pull the yarn tail tight to close the ring. Remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 1 is down. In round 2, start with one chain stitch, then work two single crochets, one increase and one single crochet in turn. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first, then work two single crochets. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Work one more single crochet. Two single crochets are down. Next, work one increase. We need to work two single crochets in the same stitch. Next, work one single crochet. Remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 2 is down. In round 3, start with one chain stitch, then work two single crochets, one increase and two single crochets in turn. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Then work two single crochets. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Work one more single crochet. Two single crochets are down. Next, work one increase. We need to work two single crochets in the same stitch. Then work two single crochets. Remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 3 is down. In round 4, start with one chain stitch. Then work three single crochets, one increase, and two single crochets in turn. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Work three single crochets. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Then work two more single crochets. Three single crochets are down. Next, work one increase, which means working two single crochets in the same stitch. Then work two single crochets. Remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 4 is down. In round 5, start with one chain stitch, then work three single crochets, one increase, and three single crochets in turn. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. 
work three single crochets. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Then work two more single crochets. Three single crochets are done. Next, work one increase, which means working two single crochets in the same stitch. Then work three single crochets. Remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 5 is down. In round 6, start with one chain stitch, then work three single crochets, two increases, and three single crochets in turn. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Work three single crochets. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Then work two more single crochets. Three single crochets are down. Then work two increases. We need to work two single crochets in each of the following two stitches. Two increases are down, then work three single crochets. Remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 6 is down. In round 7, start with one chain stitch. Then work 4 single crochets, 1 increase, and 5 single crochets in turn. Finally, end with 1 slip stitch. Work 1 chain stitch first. Work 4 single crochets. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Then continue to work 3 more single crochets. Four single crochets are down. Next, work one increase. Then work five single crochets. Five single crochets are down. Remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 7 is down. In round 8, start with one chain stitch, then work five single crochets, one increase, and five single crochets in turn. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Work 5 single crochets. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Then continue to work 4 more single crochets. Five single crochets are down. Next, work 1 increase. Then work 5 single crochets. Remove the marker and work 1 slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 8 is down. In round 9, start with one chain stitch, then work a set of three single crochets, one increase for three times. Finally, end with one slip stitch. 
Work one chain stitch first. Work three single crochets. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Then work two more single crochets. Three single crochets are done. Next, work one increase. We have demonstrated one set. Please finish the rest two sets by yourself. Work three single crochets and one increase as one set. Now three sets are done. Remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join in this round. Round 9 is done. In round 10, start with one chain stitch, then work a set of two single crochets, one increase, two single crochets for three times. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Work two single crochets. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Work one more single crochet. Two single crochets are down. Next, work one increase. Then work two single crochets. We have demonstrated one set. Please finish the rest two sets by yourself. Work two single crochets, one increase, and two single crochets as one set. Now three sets are done. Remove the marker and work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join in this round. Round 10 is done. In round 11, start with one chain stitch, then work a set of five single crochets, one increase for three times. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Work five single crochets. Place a marker in the first single crochet. Continue to work four more single crochets. Five single crochets are down. Next, work one increase. We have demonstrated one set. Please finish the rest of two sets by yourself. Work 5 single crochets and 1 increase as 1 set. Now 3 sets are done. Remove the marker and work 1 slip stitch in the first stitch to join in this round. Round 11 is done. Now break yarn, leaving a long yarn tail. Stretch a loop. Remove the hook and pull the yarn tail out. The tail is completed.